Asian channels has been published by the government. The new channel will be run by the Independent Broadcasting Authority, which will pay for setting it up. The money will come from the programmes. That will be up to the government after the bill has passed through Parliament, as Gavin Hewitt reports. Most television sets of material that differs from the mass audience programmes, like Coronation Street, Crossroads and Benny Hill, that now appear on ITV. These popular programmes will make up only a third of the intended 50 hours of programming a week. The remaining two-thirds is intended to be educational, encouraging innovation and experiment. At present, BBC and ITV roughly share the audience, but the ITV companies hope the new channel will win 15% of the viewers, 10% from the BBC and 5% from ITV. But some unofficial surveys believe it'll be nearer 8%, thereby questioning the whole viability of a second commercial channel. The service will cost nearly £80 million a year, but most of this will come from the advertising left to predict the new channel will initially make a loss, and so be tempted to seek out the mass audiences, thereby defeating the government's intention that service too should have a distinctive character of its own. Outside producers representing minority interests will be awarded greater access to the screens.